Hello, welcome to Turnip Games. I'm Mark. I'm Rob. And we are oof, doing things again. Spiders! Well, I think we, we left Yeah, spiders. we left a full cutscene in last time. Yep, so we're back. These guys have like polygonal shields. Yeah, cool stuff, cool stuff. Uh, we, uh, we left to fight for uh, what, again. 20 minutes to go find and a snap. I'll show you something that's, that I find really neat. When I um, ascend or descend and start a roll, I do yeah. a flip. Okay. I'll show you if I can. We might want to turn down a little bit more so it's not picking up on the uh, actual microphone. I got a, oh gosh. You're good, you're good. Yeah, because they're going to be hearing doubles of stuff if we don't keep it down. So, you want me to just talk while you're fighting? Um, possibly while I'm fighting, but other... Ooh! I blew up! Oh, wow, you that's did, the first time. You died already. That's a fairly similar game over screen. That's it's the same, almost. Okay. So, we, uh, we left for 20, 25 minutes to go <laughs> grab a snack. We ended up not getting any food at all. My dad has actually brought, uh, brought some of the new Budweiser line over. Um... Also, I believe that the um, micro lasers, like the the split laser, yeah, um, splits between all enemies on the screen. Looks like it because before, remember, it was going to their missiles and it was targeting separate things. Yeah. Now it's targeting separate enemies as well. Oh, you grabbed him from his shield. Remember he was blocking. Yeah, that's you? how you get rid of shields. Oh, cool! You couldn't do this in the last game though. You couldn't, right? I don't know. Uh, were there even grabs? Oh yeah, there were super grabs. I don't remember that at all. I do. Okay, cool. So in this game, you can hit dudes with the other dude. Also, my energy is going down really quick. I yeah, you're really that. getting busted up. This game is actually harder. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so Budweiser has allowed some of their... Um, or rather, I guess one of their master brewers... To come up with a new line for summer of just a variety pack and we went mm -hmm. and we tried our first one for tonight my dad brought several home we tried the vanilla the vanilla cask vanilla bourbon cask. vanilla bourbon cask and uh i think i might be a little more positive on it than you mm -hmm. but i you know i i i toss it a 7.5 out of 10 yeah it's very drinkable um, it's definitely okay can we agree that it's definitely okay? It's super okay. It's very okay. It's. N I won't ever tell anyone it's the best I've had. No. I won't I, tell I anyone it's my favorite. But uh, you know, I'd buy a case of it for cheap. Yeah. Like, hell yeah. Oh yeah, I'd pay eh, twenty five, thirty bucks for a case of it. Sure. That's actually higher than I you might be hyper than I was. Yo, look, we have the super sword. Because I'm used to paying eighteen. Look, super sword. Oh, you got the big sword from the opening. Yeah. Look at that. How did you, how did so you get big. that? I don't know. You had it just out of the cutscene? Well, like this big energy thing showed up. Cool. And I fought it. I guess it's like a power up. Power up! So I Look, would, a mummy. You know, if they made vanilla specific. Pew! Vanilla Coke is the shit. Everyone knows that. Yeah, you know it. You know it. You know what's fucking the best? Yo! You know what's fucking the best? When you kill the mummies, they turn back into raptors. Like they fucking should. Oh, that's so good. Kojima, I'm going to suck your dick if I ever meet you. You should definitely just drop to your knees and start inhaling. I mean, if you ever get the option to meet Kojima... Like, look, mummy head. And when I blow up his mummy head, he turns back into a fucking raptor. Once you knock that's his, so smart. When you knock his armor off... Like, I always thought it should do that. Because, mm, like, you look at him, and it's like... Yeah! This what? guy is just an expanded raptor! What are those big orb things that you're destroying? It said cellar. Grab him. I don't know Aww. if it's like a um, energy like store thing, or I don't know what to do with that guy. You throw him and then beat him up. Yeah. So yeah, the ra Woo! the other guys, the ra the fat raptor guys, the are heads. just, are they just raptors with armor? And when you destroy the armor, yeah, there should be a raptor there. Yeah, and I, I mean, I appreciate that, like, he took enough damage that he blows up. You can go either way. But I, I like even more that now that you've just smashed the external plates off, he's still fighting. Like, you've just cut parts off of him. 
You've shaken your head. You're doing things. You're smacking the booze out. Um. Oh, they're gonna think that was part of your explanation. I I got so fuzzy I couldn't really follow what you were saying, so I was trying to slap myself back. <laughs> You don't need to narrate what I'm doing. It's fine. I just trying to figure it the fuck oh, out. Oh, I thought it froze again. No, I jumped into a cutscene. Second boss of the game. Oh, that no. Like, six minutes later. <laughs> yeah, let's see if this one's uh, another just zone them out, like, from far away. Yeah. I feel like the, uh, whatever that multi-beam cannon thing is that z zooms in. <gasps> Yo, it's Viola. Oh, is it? She's mad. Well, she's an AI now. It's Neftis. Neftis, but the AI for Neftis is Viola. Viola, yeah. She's super mad now. And she hates it. Or does she hate it? You've done no damage yet. None. Wait, 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 wait. The enemy shield is not damaged. We you have to punch her. Uh oh. We have to grab a big ass blade. We have to pick something up. So one of these breakables should reveal a big thing, right? Yeah, yeah. power up, a power up. Did oh, it. you did it! You did the thing. Go hit her. I'm trying. But she keeps juking. Cause she knows I'm trying to smack her. Oh! Oh! So when it turns red, I can hit her. Yeah, you almost got her! Keep She's da so fucking dashy! Yeah, but you have dashes too! Oh yeah! Oh yeah, boy! It's gonna- it's only- <gasps> I did it! I did something! It's a matter of time! Oh, I pinned her to a wall! It's so good! I threw it and pinned her to a wall! You threw your sword? Yeah! That's super sick. Or is that just one of the pillars of the room? Look. Is that you? Viola? Viola? We always call her Viola. She's AI? Hey, it's Viola, yeah. Viola. Yeah, I have always said Viola. No, you didn't. We've been saying Viola. Well, then I've been mispronouncing as well. It's yep. Viola. Yeah, we definitely... My 3DS like blinking like that is really distracting me. Yeah. She died? She died? Oh, remember when we did that? Yeah, this is the first game they're referencing. You can go back and watch our playthroughs. Please do. And turn off your ad block. I have ad block on, so I don't blame you if you don't turn it off. I also we have it on. We appreciate if you turn it off. But it's turn like... Go ahead, skip the ad. It's fine. Or just click it and close the window that opens. Mm -hmm. We will absolutely love you... Uh, Mark actually told me that after dropping to his knees and sucking off Kojima, he will do the same for you. <laughs> um, uh, I can confirm this. Line up. We'll do a fan yeah, what meetup. Is it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Anubis is nearby. Anubis gonna fuck you up. Kill her. No, I want to go. Go, fight her, fight her. Ah, uh, <laughs> she cannot be a problem anymore. If you kill her, this will take like two seconds. Yeah, just finish We her. can go fight Anubis another time. Fighting Anubis is not necessary. Just kill the lady. Look, he's like resonating with us and controlling our robot through like Her resonance. Uh-oh. He's the songbird of his generation. He's songbirding us so hard. Look at him. Look at him do it. It makes me so mad. Look at him with his dog head. And wings. Look at him not care. What an asshole. You gotta beat him, though. Yeah. Ooh, look at that frame loss. Oh, man. Oh, it's dated, but it's so good. This is the second time already that we're seeing some really hard frame loss. Yeah. I guess now that adds a second complaint for me. What's that? Really, the first one being that the clear data didn't do a ton for us. Eh. And... And PS2 definitely have lots of games, uh, Dot Hack and Xeno Gears. Ooh, rather, oh, wow. Xeno Saga, Xeno uh, Saga. First complaint from me. That was the first time that the um, the frame loss actually affected gameplay. Like all the other times, it was just a thing. Yeah, I see it getting a little slow down when there's a lot of those red particles. 
But anyway, as I was saying, I would have liked the game clear data from oh, Zone wow. of the Enders 1 to play a bigger part. And I would like, you know, the frame rate to be a little more solid. Oh, hey, we got into a cutscene. Let's see what happens. I'm surprised. Let's see what cutscene thing keeps us from dying now. I'm sure Kojima saw that. What? The, the frame rate? The slowdown. He's working on a PS2, though. Yeah, he, he... Look at this. He's got a lot going on. But I'm surprised he wouldn't, you know... Why stab the head when you know he's in the dick? No, remember they move. Sometimes they're in the head, sometimes Yo, they're in the dick. Yo, look. Is Viola going to help you after you kicked her ass? Viola's ass? back. Why is she What's help? Viola doing? No, she's behind... Viola's so mad, and she... It's like... It's like Vidal. He... She wants to be the one to kill you. Viral, you mean? Yeah. From Grand. I, yeah. Grand Lagan. Yeah, I say it like the, the, the moon speak. No, that's, that's fine. I'm making Vidal. sure that the Americans watching this know. Yeah. I say it moon speak. Because it sounds cooler. Okay, this is... Yo, we're playing chicken! We're fucking allying up our... No, she's stabbing us through the stomach. Okay. I thought you were going to play chicken against Anubis. I did too. And then she hit you in the tummy. The she robot, touched my butt. The robot tummy. I didn't like it so much. He hates it. He's doing the 90s thing where your robot gets hurt and he makes a face like he is hurt. Like in Gundam. <laughs> like in yeah. Gundam where they go... Yeah. Like if your body can withstand it, the robot will withstand it. Yeah. Oh man. Uh, like oh, your no. nerves are tied to the robot, but they're not. Yeah, what's this long hallway doing? No, he just fucked off. No, it's Dingo. This must be a, a you know, like a prequel kind of thing. Ah, uh, touch me. Oh shit. Oh, it's all Evangelion. You gotta hit that. Evangelion. Oh! He's like, I love it. Do it again. I'm here for you. <laughs> so he grabs her neck. I want your love. <laughs> okay, now kiss. Oh. Normally you would have had her pants off three times by now. <laughs> oh no. It's. It's, it's Colonel Mustang. Giovanni. <laughs> It's Giovanni! <laughs> he throw, he twists his hat and he throws a Pokeball at you. No, but like, look at that. Wow, Giovanni's got tiny eyeballs. It doesn't matter. You don't need eyeballs to throw Pokeballs. His Pokeballs are his eyeballs. <sighs> she is such a Xenogears character. What? Who the fuck has two animal names? Dingo Egret. E fuck you. Is Egret an animal? Yeah, it's a bird. It's like a, uh, that's a heron. Dumb, that's a dumb animal. It's like a white heron. Is it endangered? You must be kidding. I don't think so. It sounds like it would be endangered because I haven't seen it at KFC. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're mostly down in like um, the, the southern part of the trash island. It's not funny. <laughs> like the the Floridias. The part where we keep the thirty two X's. <laughs> you mean the whole thing? The part where we keep the TJs. Oh. Look like when he talks, his teeth jut out. Yeah, that means he's angry. <laughs> like a jut. Ah! His face. He's, he's a. He's a. Like, he's a toad. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just peeked the mic out so hard, but did you see his fucking face? Yes, I saw it. I didn't think it was that funny. Now I think it's funnier. <laughs> <laughs> Is he Hispanic or black? I don't understand. Like, he was so like, hmm, I'm done with you. And then he just shot him in the back. Now he turns around and just fucking, oh my god. Hold on, hold on. Is this after the fight we were just in, or is this... I don't care. It's so dumb. Look, ah, look at his face. Like, I'm gonna go eat some. Dingo was gonna go twerk it out, and then he gets shot. Oh my god. He hates it. He's like, I'm gonna slap your tits. No, you gotta go eat that Look blood. at his face! And look at Dingo's face! And her face! The first game did not have anime cutscenes, right? It had all in game like, rendered cutscenes. Like, I love it. <laughs> I love it. It's good. You love this? Yes. Nah, I'm okay. I'm in I with this. I feel like it helps with is, their budget. 
This is silly. Is it? I don't know if it's because I'm drunk. No, it's or definitely back and forth. It's partly because we. But this is so silly. Look at him there. Look at him there, lying perfectly still. And look at her like, hair. Oh, you shot me, you fucking fucking fucker. But maybe her and hair like, would. And like, look at her being all like, I'm breathing in his blood. <sighs> That's right. You would kind of just suck in their blood, wouldn't you? Ah, well. And he's all like. <gasps> No. Choking on dicks. That's probably how you would be if you were shot twice. In space. And the blood has enough gravity to stick to his lips. So that was kind of our intro, huh? I love it, but that was silly. Like, Kojima love. Kojima is life. Kojima uh, is love. Do you know how much but stuff in Metal Gear is silly. just silly? There's a ton of just silly stuff in Metal Gear. Okay. Kojima stuff does get just really silly. Have you ever seen, like, Revolver Ocelot? Like, spinning the, the knives. And making knives. literal Guns around, like, Ocelot <laughs> sounds, too. Because sometimes, during spinning, he goes, Ah! And he just keeps spinning, and he makes these dumb mammal noises. Have you ever heard an Ocelot purr? That's what he does. No, it's like... Yeah, he does all these dumb noises. While he's fighting you, he makes... Go look, up, go look up Big Cat Rescue and listen to the ocelot purr. It's the freakiest fucking sound. But that's what I'm saying. Is but Ko- it makes me want to love one. Kojima does some silly stuff. Yeah. He's artsy. <laughs> look at him be all gun grave. He looks like a zombie. Run, run, hit. That's the first anime reference that was not started by me on this channel. What? You're referencing Gungrave out of nowhere? That's like the first anime reference on this channel. Hold that on, listen to him. He's all like... No, I, I heard it, I heard it. <laughs> I want to know how they... Like, all these stupid lines, I always want to know what the director had to say to that voice actor. You want to be a to, fly on the wall. Yes. I want to know... Like what reference they had for this part? I need you to go rah, 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 rah. Re- like really emotionally because you're troubled. Remember, you're troubled almost as much as Sora X Roxas. Speaking, look of- how much interrupting of the cutscene I can do with this. You can like- you can ruin the feels. Look at him getting all like, hype. Look how jank the mount is for this fucking camera. Like. You would expect shake her, these. shake hers, shake hers. I her. can't. I thought you said you could shake the other people's. Wait, I can! I have to press, like, <laughs> R1 or something. Talking intensifies. Okay, so while they talk to you about, like, basically nothing, earlier today, I was on RuneScape, right? Mm-hmm. And I go on to my clan chat, and I ask uh, Kimmy, or rather everyone, I just clan chat, I said... Hey, anyone, have you ever bought a game based on the soundtrack? Uh-huh. And Kimmy posts two lines of the fucking Kingdom Hearts intro theme. That had a good advertising song. The, the trailer ne- song that was good. And cutscene. Mm-hmm. But, <laughs> look at that line! The cockpit is too little to keep you alive. The cockpit is too... Yeah, the cockpit is too small for all the life support gear your lame ass needs. Yeah, but he'll willpower through it. He can do it. You don't need blood when you're angry. Oh my god, this is so much like Xenogears. Like, this is so much like Xenogears. How far down can you go? Go down. Oh, that's cool. Are you serious? Don't be so surprised all the time. Why not? Who does he sound like? Does he sound like Spike Spiegel? Demos. It's hard for a dead man to understand. No, I don't recognize that. I don't either. I really don't. 
Unfortunately, um, I wish I kind of knew. I also feel like the female I recognize almost as like Katara from from Airbender or whatever. Is it correct? Like really, really roughly. I don't, like, I don't know. Like really rough. Probably, probably not, but maybe, maybe, if it, maybe. If it is, it's one of her earlier roles before she had her, like, style. Do we go to the next cutscene, or do yeah, we go Yeah, yeah, go, go ahead, because we do, like, shorter episodes a lot of the time than the standard for, <coughs> for YouTube. Well, here's the next cutscene. <laughs> Great. This game is more cutscene heavy. It sure is. Hold on. Do we have a hub? A hub? Yeah, because she just said this is the way to the catapult. Um, oh, you can go this way. That's right, because we did have like a fast travel system in the last game. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, I'm where my tongue is moving slower than I want to talk <laughs> because of all the bud weezer. <laughs> I feel like weezer is the bud of hipster music. That's really deep, but I kind of follow it to a point where I agree, and then I can't think farther. Yo, look how much more bar we have for energy and sub. I want all that used. Well, you did use it all, though. <sighs> In the fight with Viola, you almost used it all. Yeah, but I want it larger now. Oh, you want it more girth. Yeah. <gasps> Ignore it! Connected! Right off the bat, he's like, fuck those guys. Like, this is exactly the opposite. Like, this guy is like, I want to live. I want to not, like, I want to get out of here. No, 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 no. No No heroing. No, no. Yeah, we're receiving a distress signal. Ignore it. That's his first thing. Yep. So this is an interesting thing where he's in Jehuti. I want to see how... Jehuti's weird as an AI because she's very she sticks to the AI fairly well but then she does connect she doesn't humanize little. too much but he uh, he is almost <coughs> he's very out for number one. Oh yeah much more than Leo was like a very idealistic kind of little kid do gooder who got like given a power like, and this he guy, didn't have enough time to contemplate, hey, maybe I can benefit from this. He was thrown in a giant robot. He was really innocent. When, yeah. And this guy is an adult, and he's looking out for number one. He had to spend time digging fucking Metatron ore from, out of ice on a fucking moon. What I believe might be an extension of the military. Uh-huh. He's kind of a full-grown dude bro, and he doesn't want to deal with this. And he knows it's bullshit. Mm hmm. And he's going to do things for him. Which I can relate to more. I guess. Than being like an eight year old. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so this one is going to be a very touch and go mission. We must go in here. So he was. Probably fight some robots. Leo was not returning to Hootie because he wanted to do things with it. This guy just wants to be out of the situation. Oh, we go this way. Like, Leo thought it was super sick to have Jehudi to do all the things he wanted to do. Yeah, he's like, yo, I can do I can do things while I'm here. Look at this, I can change things. Oh, shit. I didn't read what serial number he's got. Pick the green one. Oh, dear. What happened? I blew up a box. Great. Turns out it wasn't the one I need. Mission. Find Tabor hiding in one of the containers. What? Where do what? What do I do? I don't understand. I I don't understand. Um, it says find taper in one of the containers, but I don't know what to do. Go down near the ground, maybe you can leave the room and re-enter? Because you can't follow it in there anymore. They'll eight, laser eight, themselves eight. off. Please come here now. Oh, 
Oh, this is weird. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. What is this? I just... I don't know. It's like defenses. Why would... Wait, where are you now, anyway? In a thing. I have I no know. idea where you are. But it looks like I have no idea. Oh, cool. This is a thing? Yeah, just just go here. There's enemies. Yeah, I'm just gonna follow the enemies for a little while. Whoa, they're faster. Because the enemies in the last game would just stand there and take your circle or square mashes. Yeah, I mean, I... It definitely, I feel more effective. Oh, there's more boxes. Yeah. There's, uh, do the boxes. Yeah, but I don't know which box. Uh, do the green box, I told you before. No, that's not green. No! Five tons of coffee? Five tons of coffee? No! I don't know where to go! You didn't listen to me! <coughs> what do I do? <coughs> Find taper hiding in what? I don't I don't know what, what's going on. Oh. Do you wanna figure out next time? A little bit. Okay. Next time on Turnip Games I'm gonna blow up this Oh no, I did it this time! Oh no. I'm Mark. I'm Rob. This is Jabuti's butt. Oh, I can't no. look at it too good. Jabuti. There, there is. That's Jabuti. That's Jabuti. <laughs> come here now. Okay. I, you I, can I, save from the menu. I can. Ooh. Save. No data. Let's make some data. Hey Rob, let's make some data. Uh, Saving. I think we're gonna go to sleep too. Me too. Me three. Whoa. All right. Yeah, sweet rat. Okay, cool. That's really great. But if you're